This is AP News Minute. A powerful storm that unleashed snow and strong winds across the upper Midwest has left behind dangerously cold temperatures. The storm dumped up to two feet in some locations and collapsed the roof of the Minnesota Viking Stadium. The storm also closed major highways and canceled more than 1,600 flights. Senators will get their chance today to vote on a tax cut deal struck by President Barack Obama and Republicans. The White House expects the bill to pass by the end of the year. If it doesn't, tax increases will go into effect January 1st. Veteran diplomat Richard Holbrook remains in critical condition after surgery to fix a tear in the large artery that moves blood from the heart. President Barack Obama and First Lady Michelle Obama say they're praying for Holbrook's recovery. The president calls the diplomat a towering figure in American foreign policy. Sarah Palin says conditions in Haiti are much harsher than she expected. The former Alaska governor made the comment while visiting a cholera treatment center. Palin told reporters that a U.S. military airlift of supplies may be needed to help Haitians survive the latest outbreak. Ed Donahue, the Associated Press, with AP News Minute.